Hi guys, so this is just a little recap of our Zoom meeting from today, Wednesday the 15th. Um, so we started off, of course, you know, just by sharing some words that we came up with from last time. Your challenge was to make up a list of words that started with TR and words that started with SC. I'm going to show you some of my words and you can always pause it and try to read them on your own or create your own and have someone read yours and you read their list. But let's see here. Try to read. And that one. And this one. Alrighty. So after that, what we did is I showed them a really neat activity of hopscotch with sight words. So I made my own little hopscotch with sight words, and I'm going to show you how to use it. So just like normal hopscotch, you can do it inside with paper, you could do it outside with chalk, outside with paper, whatever you can do, okay? And you're going to hop in, and when you hop on it, you got to say it. Like, when, I, play, see, you, with, to, yeah! But that really didn't make any sense, did it? It was fun. So if I want to challenge myself, I can try to put them in the order to make a real sentence. So I'm going to hop on the words to read it in the sentence form. That does make sense. I like when I play. I like when I play. That made way more sense. So challenge for phonics is just to do high frequency words in a fun hopscotch way. I would love to see how you're able to do it. Now, our goal for Wednesday is to give you a take home thing for you to do with your family and for you to continue to work on with your family over time. So our thing today was a picture dictionary. Now, picture dictionaries, of course, you can look online to get some. You could use a real dictionary but I'm gonna challenge you to make it fit what you would wanna write about. You know, Miss Pittman. And so if, if I was on the letter D, I would have to write dog. Cause you know, I love to my, write my books about dogs, okay? Or maybe I could write Dalmatian in there. Cause that's the type of dog I'd wanna write about, but I may not know how to spell it. So let's think, if I'm trying to come up with words that I would want to write that start with A. I may only be able to come up with one or two right now, and that's okay. But next time I write, if I have to ask a friend or family member or teacher, how do I spell this? That's when you should think, oh, I can add this to my picture dictionary. Then I don't even have to ask again. I'll always know. It's kind of like using your word wall, but at home for you to have forever okay so you can anytime you're writing and you find something really neat to write about like if a holiday comes by and you don't know how to spell halloween you could always look it up and put it in your picture dictionary for future use i do have an example of my picture dictionary so um you could break it to, apart into different boxes like if i have a I'd say a for acorn if i love acorns if you really don't like acorns, would it make much sense for you to write acorn? No, because you probably wouldn't write a book about it if you don't like it. So only do things that you would enjoy writing about or that you like. Notice I drew it and I wrote the word. However, yours is going to look better than mine because y'all are going to have time to add details and um, to make it look real, to make it look alive. <laughs> Okay, and things like um, the American flag, alphabet. So every letter could have its own page. Or if that's a little too much and too spread out, you can break it to where every page has two letters. My A works. Apple, across, alley, ant eater, above, apricot. My B words, backbone. Blue bonnet. I love blue bonnet. I would totally write a poem about it. I could find how to spell it in my picture dictionary. So 
try to come up with stuff for every letter. This is something that just can continue to grow over time. Um, and is a great resource for writing as well. Okay, so the homework is to go back on Sway to first review your 3D shape video, review your the coin video, keep up those tic-tac-toe challenges. Alrighty, guys, have a wonderful Wednesday.